Hey guys, I'm Mike. I'm Laura. We are Match Mead in Heaven, and today we are going to install a vanity in the bathroom remodel. Vanity yes. and sink. We purchased at Lowe's. Why did you like this one that we're installing, honey? Well, the reason I liked it is it was cheap enough to where I could get a mirror that I liked. So I had to, uh, what do you call it? Negotiate. I had to negotiate. So in order to get the mirror I liked, I had to get the cheaper vanity. Maybe we'll do another video on the mirror and tell how we like it. Maybe. Maybe we might not like it. You think we'll like it? I think we will love it okay. if it fits in this little space. Well guys, keep watching. Uh, if, if you're looking for a bathroom vanity and sink, uh, maybe this product is one you're looking at at Lowe's and this will be helpful to you. We're going to do a quick install and uh, get this guy uh, installed in our new bathroom. Thanks for watching. If you like Match Made in Heaven, subscribe. Turn on notifications. Hit the little bell. Yes. Ding, ding. Yes. And give us some comments. Tell us uh, what videos we could do or how we can do things a little better. Uh, we love the community side of the house. So have a great day. Thanks for watching. to do today is install this vanity we purchased from Lowe's uh, style selections um, vanity with top it has a white top we'll be putting that in uh, previously uh, in this remodel of this bathroom we had a vanity that extended both walls <clears throat> And when we removed that vanity, it was very, very tough because it extended both ways. You had to basically lift that thing straight up uh, in the air to get it out, and it was very problematic. So we chose a uh, not as wide, not to extend to both walls. This is Laura's uh, directions, and we will be doing the install today. So we thought we would show you this style selections as we put it together from Lowe's, we'll include the link to the item uh, in the description. So we've checked in for level and we have found some studs. And then of course we put him in the center and measured from the wall in. We've got the same distance in on both sides. I have him in the center. My pipes gonna be perfect. And what we're gonna do now, uh, I located a stud here. So I'm gonna put one here and I'm hoping there's a stud here and then we'll be able to secure him to the wall. I did clean the fixture. We are reusing the Feister, Feister, P-F-I-S-T-E-R. Most of our uh, Ulra bronze uh, fixtures are deltas, but this one is not. So I did take it apart Pop these guys here off, cleaned a little bit. We got some water build up and things. The lot was around here. Uh, Pop those guys off, connected them, secure. Took off my filter here by turning here, cleaned it out. <clears throat> and then I'm cheating. I'm going to, I've already hand tightened here. And now I'll put some plumber's tape on and connect uh, here that'll save me from getting in the floor and leaning up backwards to connect those so I'm cheating a little bit here and then put some <coughs> bond on the bottom here and then we'll set this vanity top in this Loctite bond uh, bonding putty put it around and then set it in since I'm doing this install myself today, I'm also going to cheat instead of laying down, looking up. I've used my plumber's putty, built my seal here, and I'll be sticking that through and connecting it while I can use both hands very easily and put it in straight. You can see that I've already made my connections here. 
and I'll be ready to drop this sink in to the vanity here momentarily. Here's some details on the sink if you're interested. Make another water connection here with the 3 8 inch. I've already connected up high. Connection. So we got our packs. Pop that guy in. And then <clears throat> pop the packs in there and then connect that 3 8 inch on. We'll be good. Put the uh, hardware on. Pretty simple. You know, just a screw. And then the, uh, or a bolt and the knob. Wanted to show you the inside in case you're looking at this, <clears throat> making this purchase from Lowe's. Pretty, pretty good quality there. Now it doesn't uh, close slowly though, um, but not too bad. What we like about it is it's open in the back, so we had to paint first so that we could get that in. But ready to go. This top is doesn't open. It's just uh, solid. <clears throat> we do like the bottom of being open though. So we had to of course get the floor down first. The laminate floor. Screw did you <laughs> did you decide to contribute to the installation? <laughs> Finally. I was at church. Oh. That's a good place to be. I was there too today. You went early. I went okay. the next. What you doing? What are you contributing? I'm putting a little sticky thing. Let me see. You got sticky things? These little gel thingies. Oh, okay. So when you shut it. it oh. Well, it still is loud. It still is loud, but, but there's jelly things there now. Yes. I see. Jelly. You want to change your knobs? Yes. Yeah, I figured you would want to change your knobs to the oil rub bronze, correct? Correct, because I don't like that. That's pretty. That one sounded better. Maybe I missed it. Did you put it too, too low? Maybe. You messed up? bottom one it's too high. Is it going to have enough sticky? Well, maybe. Can't get my fingernail under it. That's still too high. Why don't you go to the very bottom, honey? I, that is the very bottom. That's better. That's better. Looks good. Looks good. I like it. I ran into one issue on my plumbing. Yeah. This one is a little higher than the other, but um, we made it work. And uh, next installer or home owner, I'm sorry. I ran that PEX right underneath of that. Uh, and you can fuss, you can fuss at me when I'm gone and dead and buried. That was my goof. I shouldn't have done that. I should have put it to the side. Hey, nobody's perfect. Thanks for watching. By the way, don't forget to check out our merchandise on Teespring. Appreciate your support. Have a great day.